Hey everybody, welcome back to the Mila and Michelle show. This is Mila, the Frenchie warrior. You can follow her at mila.frenchie.warrior. And right now it's dinner time. So I'm gonna show you exactly what we do for dinner and why I chose these products and these foods. So you can mimic what we do. And we got our OnlyFans gear on and we are ready to go because she is hungry. So I've been switching Mila to some raw food because we're traveling more and having lightly cooked fresh food is not conducive for traveling. We also use stainless steel bowls and Mila has a slow feeder in there because she is one of those down the hatch kind of girls. So she likes to inhale her food. So the first thing I do is I do mix her raw food here with uh, some water. So I'm gonna do that first to let it soak up all the juices. And we use Small Batch. Now, Small Batch is just a brand of food. There's plenty of brands. Mila, sit. Okay, sit. She's really excited. So Small Batch is a brand of food that's just really healthy. The ingredient panel is really clean and it's kept us out of the vet. And that's what I'm all about. So anything to keep us out of the vet. So I'm just gonna smash it up. And Mila is just gonna watch every moment of it because she is very excited. But it definitely needs to absorb the food. I know that you can give these for like snacks, but Mila has a sensitive stomach. So if you have a dog with a sensitive stomach, this is definitely a great option. Um, but you gotta go slow. We've been transitioning to this raw food for over three weeks. Okay, wait, wait. The other thing I use is real meat. And so this is what the product looks like in the bag. It's a really great product. This is venison and I'll do in another video, I'll show you why we chose the uh, venison. But anyway, we have some of it chopped up already because Mila likes to inhale her, ho her food. So I grind it up in the blender. I just put it in the slow feeder and I put that on first. And then for her fiber, I alternate between organic pumpkin, which I get at Trader Joe's Pumpkin has um, an effect two different ways from what the vet has taught me. It can help your dog go to the bathroom, but it also can help them, you know, not go to the bathroom. So you just have to use a little bit and monitor and see what's best for your dog. So Mila loves pumpkin. We had it at lunch today, so we're not gonna have it tonight for dinner. Instead, we're gonna do ground flax seeds. So this you can get at any healthy grocery store or on Amazon. So we get uh, organic golden flax meal. And I'm gonna just put a teaspoon in there and it really just helps firm up uh, her bowel movements. So I'm all about no diarrhea. I don't know about you, but I don't want any diarrhea. So that's that. And then I do one slider. So she also eats the, the small batch lightly cooked. And it looks like this. It's just basically turkey thawed out. I'll put one of those in there. Mila is getting ready. You ready for dinner, Mila? And then I just mush it on top. And one of the other things that I've used since she was a puppy and had a couple surgeries, so Mila had emergency stomach surgery because she decided to eat a pound of raw rice, which was pretty much gonna kill her. Um, so we love her vet, Dr. Denton, who saved her life and her nurse, Marcy and Ben. So a lot of what I've learned has been just to avoid going to see them. And we use this product, I love Animal Essentials. It's a line of products that they have We've done the liver one. We've done, um, when she was younger, before her spay, she had a lot of frequent urination. So the urine one, it's been great. But the colon one is really great if, they, if you see any loose stool, but also just for colon maintenance. So I put, a, I put the dose for her in her food and I do that like once or twice a day. We also travel with this, if you saw my travel video. And then for the raw food, I just pour it right on top. So it looks like that, not the nicest, but she loves it. And then it is dinner time. So we will go down to the ground and you can watch Mila eat her dinner. But those, that's pretty much what she eats. And then we also use for training raspberries, strawberries, and some bananas. So um, Mila, are you ready for dinner? Yeah, can you sit? Oh, that's such a good girl. Kiss. She's like, no, I just want to eat. Okay, you ready for dinner? 